Hey, welcome back. So I want to talk about some advanced use cases for Copilot for Microsoft 365. And in this video, I want to start to dive into those advanced use cases around using Copilot to be more productive around meetings. Look, we all attend meetings. It, they can be very draining sometimes, um, but it's just kind of a fact of life. And so how can we get the most out of our meetings? How can we be more productive and be more efficient? Well, Copilot to the rescue. Here we have a meeting where I had, a, uh, I had attended a presentation from a vendor where they presented to me about Microsoft Copilot for security and gave me a nice brief and an overview of that product. Well, I recorded the meeting and Copilot for Microsoft 365 automatically took notes for me. So after the meeting, I can come into Teams here, click on the recap tab of that meeting, and I can see those meeting notes that Copilot automatically took for me. Now I can also see that at the bottom of these notes, there's some follow-up tasks. These were any action items that were discussed during the meeting. So this is great, but I also had a few team members that were not able to attend the meeting. So not only do I want to send them these notes and follow-up tasks, but I also want to give them a nice executive summary. So how do I do that? Well, Copilot to the rescue. Let's go to Copilot for Microsoft 365 inside Teams, and let's give it a prompt here. I'm going to say, please write an executive summary summarizing the recent meeting on Copilot for Security for members of the team that could not attend. And I'm gonna say using, I'm gonna put the slash key and reference a file using the Copilot for Security briefing meeting. So here's that actually recording that we had from the meeting. And I'm gonna send that prompt to Copilot. Now, as we've talked about in previous videos, the more effort I put into a prompt, the more thought I put into it, the higher the quality of the response and output. So if I just give it one or two words, I'm not gonna get much. If I give it some more thought, then I'll get a lot more higher quality output. So here we go. So here's the output from Copilot. It gives me a nice overview here of the meeting, kind of what was discussed. And then that's great for me to use, maybe in my email to my team that couldn't attend. And then of course I could attach the meeting notes that came out of uh, Copilot from from here, from the meeting itself. So that's just a quick and dirty way to get a little bit more information about the meeting. Stay tuned because in the upcoming videos, I'm gonna talk about how to interact with Copilot after a meeting and how you can use it to get more information about the meeting you just attended. So stay tuned and we'll chat soon in the next video.